girdle kit comes with the main bearing girdle, modified lower crankcase and baffle assembly, all the main studs, washers, nuts, and hardware for installation on the 6.6 .6 Duramax diesel engine. After the engine has been assembled and all clearances and specifications checked, remove the main cap nuts and washers. Then remove the two dowels in the rear of the block and also the oil pump to pick up tube studs. Now trial fit the girdle on the block making sure that all the bolt holes line up and everything fits properly. Now thoroughly clean the pan rail with carburetor cleaner and apply a 1 16th inch bead of silicone to the pan rail. Don't use anaerobic sealer as it may set up too fast. We use the right stuff by Permatex. Now spread the silicone to make a thin film. Now clean the girdle with carburetor cleaner. Next install the girdle and a few bolts for alignment. Now install the three center main cap support bars. Next lube all the washers and studs with ARP Molly Lube and install the washers and nuts. Now torque the nuts in three steps, 100, 150, and 200 foot pounds. Now install the oil pump pickup screen and torque both the studs and the bolts to 18 foot pounds. Now rotate the crankshaft assembly, checking the clearance between the girdle, crankshaft, connecting rods, and oil pump screen. Now clean the girdle and apply a 1 16th inch bead of silicone. Then clean and install the modified lower crankcase assembly. Next install the lower crankcase bolts and tighten them finger tight only. Now install the two remaining transmission adapter bolts and snug them up. Now alternating, tighten the oil pan bolts and the transmission adapter bolts to evenly bring the pan back and down against the block. Now torque the oil pan bolts to 15 foot-pounds and the transmission adapter bolts to 67 foot-pounds. We have just completed the installation of our main bearing girdle for the Duramax 6.6 .6 engine. We realize that your time is valuable and appreciate you taking the time to watch this video. Thanks again.